Rosenberg scum rule this region from their citadel in the south. We shall tear it down, brick by brick. Hey, how are you? Noxus Flack here, and welcome to another Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition single player campaign video. Again, I start this off, and there's no music. What the heck is that? Please let me know in the comments below. But today we are going to start the final campaign of the Dawn of the Dukes campaign in Eastern Europe, the land of the Slavs. And that is, uh, is that Jan Ziska? Maybe. You let me know how it's pronounced in the comments below. Before I start this and start reading this, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to see more Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition campaign playthroughs. I am playing through as every single one and it is a huge amount of my time. All right, Janziska, 1405 to 1424. There's the music. One-eyed Janziska spent his youth as a mercenary fighting for honor and coin, but his destiny changed forever when he heard the preachings of the reformer John Hus in Prague. As a champion of the Hussite cause and leader of the Invincible Armies, Ziska shattered existing notions of warfare with technological and technical innovations. Cement the legacy of one of history's greatest generals by galvanizing mere peasants into highly disciplined units and leading them to triumph over the Holy Roman Emperor's knightly armies. In this campaign, you will play as the Bohemians. The Bohemians are one of the new groups in Dawn of the Dukes. And if we ever end up in Prague, maybe I'll see a last name that looks like mine. Let's start with part one, the one-eyed Wanderer. When magnets quarrel, the realm trembles and commoners bleed. My beloved Bohemia has been enveloped by a grim shadow, led by the devious and cruel Heinrich of Rosenberg. Some of our more ambitious lords have formed the so-called Union of Nobility and deposed King Wenceslaus. In a world governed by God and greed, it seems that not even monarchs are safe. Now I too have been swept up by this chaos. They call me Jan Zizka for the eye that I lost in my youth. For most of my life I tended to my family's small estate in Trotsnova, while all around me our homeland slowly went to the dogs. Once I inherited the land, I sold it to seek my fortune in Prague where I became a retainer of the court. Now, with no king to serve and enemies closing in on all sides, I must once more forge a new life for myself. Having gathered what little I own, I set out into the country. There, in this vibrant land of verdant forests, majestic mountains, and rushing rivers, I shall seek out those bold men who would join me in a desperate battle against this foul tyranny. My enemies take me for a fool, mocking me as one-eyed Zizka, but it is they who cannot see. Like the one-eyed god of whom the men in the far north tell tales, I have a talent for the art of war. All right, so I think the the art of this storybook cutscene is my favorite of the new three, and I like the j the you know the jig we're doing right now. This is cool. It does feel rather picturesque, medieval. Feels like I'm at a Renaissance festival. Destroy Heinrich of Ronsburg's castle. Castle age pop cap of 75. That's oppression. You have no way to obtain villagers. Plunder enemy convoys, farms, and villages to acquire resources. And scout the map for production buildings to assume control of. Ronsburg castle is heavily fortified. Avoid until you have large. Yep. Destroying short term. Conquering long term. Continue to impress him with successful blah blah blah. Okay. 
The Rosenberg scum rule this region from their citadel in the south. We shall tear it down, brick by brick. Okay. Um, so this is the castle we, we need to destroy. We will need resources to sustain our army. It's beautiful. Harry these lands and rob our enemies so that we might eat instead. Okay, so we're stealing. Not super, not super into that. I am in fact opposed. Hello. Uh, you let's are get a unique some. specimen, Yama Trotsnova. I shall watch your exploits with keen interest. So can I, uh, after I take these guys out, is this mine? settlement will provide us with meager supplies. But if we are in a pinch, we can burn it and take its stockpiles for our own. <laughs> it's a bit much, huh? Uh, can we get a scout cavalry? Uh, you guys are on the attack. You're gonna go city to city. Scout cavalry is gonna actually look right. Uh, so, uh... I don't know if uh, upgrading my units was the right move for sure, but we'll find out soon enough. Hello, you're going to be control group one. Tell me what's over here, and then what's over here, and then what's over here, over here, over here, and then. Yeah, just run around. Rooting for you. Okay. Got a bunch of stuff here. Other oh, patrolling, okay. We can pass to these cows north of our camp. Their milk will keep our bold fighters strong. Okay. Brought messages and box to you by the Take this gold and hire some nips. Run like a man. Was that my boy? That was my boy. This settlement will provide us with meager supplies. But if we are in a pinch, we can burn it and take its stockpiles for our own. Alright. Message received. Let's walk a little faster. Do more damage to buildings. Um, let's just get five battering rams. Why not? <clears throat> so I think our hero unit heals himself. Yeah, he does. It's pretty slow, though. So when they say um, meager supplies, what do they what do they mean exactly? Like, am I gonna get some stuff sent to me? Like, is that coming? So there's gonna be units there, so I'm gonna avoid that. We've totally messed up that strategy. It has gone poorly. I'm just scouting. La la la. Ya ya ya. It's a bit spicy. Well, I think your fate's a bit sealed, so. Oh, wait, what? No, no. Your fate is not sealed. Is that something we could take behind? It seems like a bit much. Uh, I've noticed our food supply has gone up. I don't know how to me I was expecting a message to show up. Pardon me. For some reason I thought pressing enter would show me the old messages. I don't know where that thought came from. Hello. Um. Build some soldiers, everything's okay. Oh, goodness gracious! Please ignore me! Oh no! Yes, well. Yes. So we still need to take this one. Oh, 
All I actually have to do is destroy this beautiful castle. Oh, why do I need to do that? That's so upsetting on so many levels. Destroy local economic buildings. But why? Gotta say, I'm not super into the idea. Also, where are these cows hiding? Let's get a, another light cavalry out here. You're gonna be control group zero. You are control group one. Hello. I am curious. How do I get there? Teach what me. What is this? More rats come to spoil so our wish. supply stores. Saddle up, my knights. We will have to bomb. say about that. I mean, I kind of get it. I mean, like, you haven't even like sold me on why we're doing this. Just, we're just raiding peaceful villages and they're pretending like it's all a hunky dory over here. Half expect to find 16 cows. Hello. Hey, how are ya? Oh, it's so beautiful. I don't want to do this. Oh, this juke juke ya. Oh, oh, nice try. Oh. Okay. So I'm gonna need forces to be able to deal with that, and then after that, five rams should do it. Do you hear the rhythm of boots and the din of thundering hooves? No. My armies come to stomp you out like the vermin that you are. So you guys are not very nice of him. Um, I am a bit curious though, like, what does that actually look like? What does his army coming to stomp me out look like? Yes. I assume it doesn't look good for me. Uh, I don't think they're gonna attack my base. I think they're gonna attack me, but I could be wrong. Let's go and take this. Four out of four, next one. There we go. I would like this village. Hello? So presumably this is the wood production place? Maybe less hesitation, less less Age of Empires pathing, please. This settlement will provide us with meager supplies. But yes. if we are in a pinch, we can burn it and take its stockpiles for our own. This seems like a bad long-term strategy. Get in there. Do what you were born to do. Rosumim. It's the boys. <laughs> Loving the cows just in the background. I love Age of Empires. Animal noises so much. <laughs> All right. Well, that new uh, wood camp that we ga got is uh, pretty helpful, I would say. But we're gonna need more than just that. We're gonna definitely need knights. 
Vaším zdravím žádám, co přikazuješ. Vaším službám. Ano. To zbraně. Vaším službám. Ano. Ano. One more ram to fill. What do we got? Two, three. Ano. Co přikazuješ? Ano. Bojujeme. Co přikazuješ? Vaším službám. Oh, that's the perfect amount. That's weird. All right, so now the attack force is going to get a bunch of pikemen. Ano, to zbraně. Vaším službám. All right, very, very good. Well, that's happening. Honestly, like, why shouldn't I be lying? What, did, what reason is there for me not to be lying? What's over here? Cows, tell me what's over here. Nothing. It's very disappointing. Alright, well, I guess we'll wait for these to build, and afterwards we will attack? Is that. Does that sound good to everybody? I think it does. Did I use that opportunity to use the restroom? You'll never know for sure. Alright. Two more nights and then I'll be happy. And then, uh, unrelated to the offensive group, we'll have these guys in the back. Um, any ones that get built before the two nights can join. They're allowed to join the cool group. Yep, the rest of them will just be like the second attack force. No one in here doesn't say that my hero can not die, so that's a thing, I guess. All right, let's go. Don't know how we feel about that. Do you hear the rhythm of boots and the din of thundering hoofs? I do not. My armies come to stomp you out like I don't, the vermin that you are. I don't hear it, actually. Like, it, what's going on? Dum 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 dum. So there's gonna be a big fight after this bridge. It's gonna be cool. Honestly, I just want you to do it that. Very cool. So I remember there were two green army groups on patrol. You cover yourself in glory without becoming arrogant, Now gird your armies with this equipment as well. Ah. We have been given ballistics. Very cool. Seeing these cavalry just hindered by the slow moving infantry is the worst. Thank goodness we had Squire's research. It would be so much worse. Or a pop cap, or as I like to call it, oppression. I can appreciate a man who fights valiantly under unfavorable conditions. I offer you these fighting men as a token of my favor. 
Now bring fire and ruin to our traitorous enemies. I haven't been sold on the traitorous enemy part of the discussion. Alright, um, it's bringing me great Your pain to attack the Bohemian. I am here to dispatch you to the fires of hell! But I left the castle long ago. No, ah, it's so pretty. I don't like doing that. Bravo, Yanzisko. Bravo. Take this gold and hire some mercenaries. Justice pursues you at the point of a blade, Henrik. Run while you can, you lousy fiend. All right. It is strangely gratifying to destroy the livelihoods of those who have extinguished your own. Yet, life on the road as a hired sword is perilous. When you walk the edge of a knife, any error may prove fatal. While I was busy raising the Rosenberg fortress to a smoldering ruin, Heinrich's forces captured a mercenary band led by my own brother. For refusing to give us up, he was cruelly slain along with his men. I came too late to rescue him, and my rash decision left me chained in a cell, awaiting my grim fate. I can only pray to God that I might prove as steadfast and unyielding in the face of torment and death as my brother was. It's a fairly simple story so far, but I'd say that was pretty cool. Uh, I'm now noticing, um, now that we've completed part one, that part two is on a separate piece of paper because it's uh, not actually here geographically in like modern like Czech Republic seems to be where we are. Uh, this is in between Poland and the Teutonic Order from the last two campaigns that we did prior. So, but there you have that's part one, the one-eyed wanderer. I'm gonna say it now, face scars and people with one eye are cooler than people without face scars or people with one eye. So I'm already on board with Jan Zitska. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. As always, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to see more. And you wanna make sure you don't miss episode two? Hit the bell and I will come straight to your phone, which might sound scary, but trust me, it'll be a good time. All right, this has been Noxus Flack and I will see you in part two, Courage and Coin.